What's up guys, welcome to Grapple. Admit it, we all love water slides. They're not only fun, but also give us a huge adrenaline rush. However, water slides are not always safe. If precautions are not taken seriously, one can easily fall off of one and potentially become victim to some serious injuries. Imagine how much it would hurt falling off of a water slide. Just the thought of it alone freaks me out. Anyways, today, this is exactly what we're going to be talking about. Here are a few people who got injured or almost got injured on a water slide. Before we get started though, make sure to leave a comment down below. Have you ever almost fallen off of a water slide? If so, which one was it? And which theme park was it from? Also, don't forget to subscribe, that way you enter in in our monthly shoutout giveaway. Number 6. In this terrifying moment, a man from Texas flew off of a homemade water slide and landed feet below onto a rocky cliff. David Salmon, the man in the video, posted this slow motion video of him falling off of the slide to his Facebook page, writing, broke my arm and fractured my ribs. Ouch. The video racked millions of views and went viral, which is great and all, but was it worth the broken arm or fractured ribs? I don't know. Fortunately, David was lucky enough to avoid any surgeries, but it took him quite a few months to fully recover. I mean, it makes sense. You did fall off of a slide onto a rocky cliff. That would mess anybody up. Here's a clip of this incident with audio. Be prepared though, it's rough. Number 5 This man could be paralyzed for life after breaking his neck on a water slide in Spain recently. 23-year-old David Brifot snapped two vertebrae in his neck and injured his spinal cord after plunging head first down the slide at Aqualandia in Benidorm on the 8th of July 2019. He is now on a life support machine and his family has been warned he could be paralyzed from the chest down. An online fundraising was done for him to support his huge medical expenses of 75000 The family has released video footage of the heartbreaking accident as they have called for an investigation into the safety of the slide. In the video clip filmed by a friend, David can be seen going down the slide, and things do not go well for him. Here, take a look at this unfortunate accident. Number 4 up next, we have for you a really hilarious video of a large man who almost fell off of this water slide. Although things did turn out fine in the end, it could have been a lot worse. So this man tries his favorite water slide, but due to his large body, he ended up launching a lot higher than he was supposed to. But thankfully, his landing wasn't as bad as it could have been. Talk about too close for comfort. Here, have a look. <laughs> <laughs> Number 3 Caleb, a 10-year-old kid, was riding in the front of the raft of this water slide, when unfortunately, he fell out. The accident tragically took Caleb's life, who sustained a fatal neck injury. The investigators were not very sure as to what went wrong, but that didn't stop them from banning the water slide completely to avoid any future mishaps, which I understand. It was indeed one of the most shocking and saddening events in the park's history, and no amount of sympathy is enough to make up for the kid's life who loved playing baseball and giving hugs. Rest in peace, Caleb. Due to the incident, the ride's designer and construction company were charged with 18 counts, including second-degree murder. They were also charged for injuring 13 others who rode the same water slide in the past. The case settled with a sum of $20 million awarded to the family of Caleb, who described the incident as a result of the park's neglect. 10-year-old Caleb Schwab was visiting Schlitterbahn in Kansas City when he climbed the metal stairs to the top of the world's tallest water slide in one of the park's main attractions. The mother was screaming, he's not moving, that's my boy. The boy did not survive the ride, suffering a fatal neck injury. Number two. 
Next up, we have this terrible 18-year-old man who picked up and pushed an 8-year-old kid over the railing as they were waiting in line at a water park. The poor kid fell off of the 31 feet high railing onto the concrete floor below, sustaining some serious injuries. The boy was conscious and breathing when the officers arrived, and fortunately he wasn't too beaten up. The 18 year old man responsible for this incident, identified as Roman Adams, picked up and pushed the boy over the railing as they were waiting in line. Why though? Well, authorities said that Adams has developmental disabilities, which could be the reasoning for this terrible action. Authorities did also mention though that Adam did in fact know right from wrong in this situation, so even with his developmental disabilities, there's no excuse for this. Roman was rightfully charged with third degree assault. Here's a clip of the news report. And we learned that um, an 18 year old adult um, had picked that child up and thrown him over. Police say Roman Adams of Maple Grove threw the boy because he was mad that the line was taking too long. They later learned Adams has cognitive disabilities and that a personal care assistant was with him at the park, but not in line with him for the slide. Police say the boy suffered several broken bones, but luckily survived. They say lifeguards were quick to help him until police arrived. Number one. Next up, we have this guy who posted this video onto his YouTube channel that went extremely viral. His sister, who was taking a ride with him, fell off of the raft and sustained some minor injuries. Fortunately, the lifeguards were very quick to rescue the poor lady, and she was taken to the hospital immediately. In the video, she can be clearly seen enjoying the ride to the fullest before taking a heavy knock on her head. Ouch. She lost control of the handles that were on the raft, and things got messy from that point on. Now, this situation does suck, but things could have turned out a lot worse. Thankfully, this situation was handled very well by the park's management. Here's a clip. You okay? She's better off the curb, back the curb, huh? 